All right, happy Halloween, everybody. It is time to play some more Friday the 13th to start tonight. Uh, we're going to see if we can <laughs> figure anything else out in this game. I did not look up any more stuff about the game, so I'm just going to play it again just to have fun. Uh, I do enjoy this game, actually. Welcome in. Thanks anybody who watched my first run of this, so this will be my second run attempting this. Then we're going to play... Some State of Decay 2 in the Lethal Zone for the first time ever. Still don't even know what map I'm going to, but I guess we'll choose one uh, that we haven't been to in a bit. So let's get this one going. It is the best day of the year. Um, and what better way than to play some old school horror. Here we go. Trying to turn down the fan so you guys aren't hearing too much of that. There we go. Alright, let's get it going. Uh, I guess we'll start with... Debbie's usually our starter, isn't she? So let's let's be her. I still don't know how to make our way through the woods or anything. That's like the toughest part here. I guess we should just check the house that we're in first. Actually, no. We need to get a torch. Torch, a knife, anything that's, you know, anything we can find. Oh shoot, where is he? He's all the way over there. Now we gotta go back. Hopefully we can find something good in our way. We gotta keep going. Do -do 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 -do. Torch. Uh, try and make it there. Guess it don't really matter which way we go. Okay, next house. <laughs> this is a really hard game, but it's uh, it's oddly fun. I don't, I don't know. Like, there we go. We got Mark. Where is he? Where is Jason? Oh, jeez. That scared me. Come on, Debbie. See, when the dodging command works, it's like actually fun in here. Doing this because it does remind me of punch out a little bit just not quite as fluid there we go okay now we gotta go find some items hopefully before he pops back up now maybe we'll change into mark because he's fast we gotta get around and see if we can get some items quickly we need a torch. Come on, drop some items for us. There's the cave. I don't want to go in there. Where is he now? Oh, he's literally right here. And it's George. Jeez. Oh man, Mark's gonna die. Come on, Mark. See, it didn't dodge that time. All right, we're live. And he's popping up way too often right now. I need to get health for him. We gotta keep Mark alive. Let's get out of this area too, so we can go back. So far, no items are dropping. Not good. Not good at all. Yeah, I'm gonna try and get all these, whatever I record today, <laughs> hopefully to get up on the channel on, on YouTube on Halloween. Um, so we'll see. 
There's a lighter. That's something. Now we have to go that way. Now here's a house that we can light. A while. There we go. I think if we get the torch, that's probably... I'm guessing that's what does the most damage to him. Maybe it helps us kill him, like, faster. I'm assuming. Now let's keep going this way. We gotta take this path. And I think we go... I don't, actually, I don't even know which way to go. Nope, the other way. Oh no, this is the way. Whoop. You punk! How am I supposed to dodge that? Mark is dead, just like that. Let's be Lara then. That was impossible to dodge. Going the wrong way. Looking to see if they're gonna give me any items before I go. Knife would be great. There's a lighter. At least somebody else has one. Right, I gotta go. You freaking bird. Okay. One of this house has a fireplace too. Oh shoot. Come on. Oh, there we go. All right. So you can almost counter sometimes, if you're quick enough. There we go. Okay. Now, is there a lighter in here? No, there's not a fireplace in here. It's just an inconvenient area for us to be. Freaking, I hate the birds. They're so hard to dodge. Now, where is he? I don't have time to do anything because I'm just constantly trying to go where he is. Oh good, we got health, okay. You know, I'm gonna go back to this house and light this fireplace. So I think there's one here. I say there. Hey hello Jack! Welcome into our Halloween, zeroween, I guess spooktacular for the day. <laughs> oh, wait, there's a note here. Go into the cabin near the cave. No, I don't want to do that. I feel like this game mocks me sometimes. Alright. Uh, hmm. Okay, keep going this way. Jeez. Come on, drop a knife, somebody. There's one. Perfect. All right, now we gotta we gotta win this fight with Laura. Right, there's Paul. Oh shoot. How's that? Okay, now what? Um, okay, which ones have we lit? Uh, let's finish the ones on this ring, I guess. And then we'll start more of the outside ring. The lake ring, the rock ring, or the cave ring, and then we'll do like the main ring. So 
So let's finish the lake ring of houses. I'm hoping for more health to drop now at this point. Anything good? Oh, I had a cold. Are you recovering a little bit? Yeah, I think it's that time of the year. The weather changing. Yeah, I'm, uh, Jessie's just getting over COVID right now. She's she doesn't have it anymore, but she's still recovering a bit. Luckily, I have not gotten it again either right now. See if we can find this. There we go. Like I kind of understand how to navigate these houses now. It, it looks awful, but it's not that bad. Once you get used to it. Double the knife. No. All right, now we have all the houses in the lake ring. We need to go towards the outer ring now. Remember the forest has like the wolves. I don't know how we're gonna deal with them. All right, let's go. Let's go this way. Okay, now we're here. Light this one. We're gonna do this outer ring and then maybe work on the cave ring. There we go. There was a note somewhere. There's a machete hidden somewhere in the cave. Oh. Yeah, I would never be able to find that. If it's anything like the woods, there's no way I'll be able to navigate. No way, guy. <laughs> Absolutely not. Okay. I mean, I guess we got, I don't think we've ever been in the cave yet, so maybe we could try. Let's go in here. I want to get the houses first that need Lighting up. Okay. And right, now we have to go. There's one more house in this loop. Jason doesn't bother us. Let's just try the cave. Like, I don't. Could ruin the whole run, but I don't. Oh, shoot, no. We have to go now, because he's. Oh, he's at, uh. He's over there. We gotta go. Freaking bird. There are a couple health potions here. Okay, now we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta get to the lake. So many zombies popping up now. Come on. 
All right. Now he's got his toothbrush, and come on, Lara. We have a couple health things left, but it's only good for like one hit, really. There we go. Let's get the heck out of here with Laura. Damn it, see if you're like... Seems just because they pop up out of nowhere here. This part really is hard to... Ugh. So hard to dodge here. Because you're so slow, your momentum is so slow. Alright, we're gonna go back to the outer ring, I guess. Come on, give me some more health. Nice if we could find some more health on our way. Hey, whoa, what is this weapon? Is that the machete? So let's go see if we can get a few hits on him with this. Coming over there. Gotta be so careful though. Come on! Next house, I believe, yep. Yeah. I'm gonna go light this one. Go into one of the cabins by the lake. <laughs> There's so many cabins by the lake. How would you know? It's like half the cabins are by the lake. Next house. Come on, give me another health thing. I gotta be so careful here. Come on, Laura. This doesn't do a ton of damage to him. I think if you defeat him, obviously you win. <sighs> His health's like not even halfway down yet. Let's change into Chrissy now. See if we can get her some items. Um, oh gosh, what? Wow, okay. Did that do damage to him or what? Oh, he's... Gosh damn it. Oh my gosh, that's so hard. We haven't had enough practice with him. On those kind of situations, so that was... Didn't really know what to do there. It falls slow. He might not be very fast. You know, he may not be very tall, but he's slow. Um, hmm. Let me have a, uh, oh, we'll pause. Let me have a sip of the coffee here, guys. Which is always a challenge when I'm wearing this. Lift this up. 
There we go. Got a little bit of caramel, caramel syrup. Zero sugar caramel syrup, so it's like a, it's not a sugar sweetener, so pretty good. Yeah, looking forward, we're gonna watch some horror movies here later. Um, probably gonna watch Idle Hands, The Hollow, maybe Goosebumps, maybe Hocus Pocus 1. Let's have a good time. Um, I was watching the Union game yesterday, can't believe they're in the cup. I'm so excited. So after this run, I think we'll just do maybe one attempt to this before we go to State of K2. However we do here, we still have four characters left, so we're doing pretty good. This is probably our best run yet. <laughs> um, Paul may not get there in time. He doesn't have a lighter, does he? You need to get him a lighter. Yeah. Oh, he does have a lighter. Alright, Paul, do some damage. Yeah! This has got to be the closest we've ever come to killing him. <laughs> we have his health almost halfway down. Alright, let's go. Let's see if we can get him. Have we lit all the cabins? No, not the ones in the woods. As I said, let's go, let's go towards the cave and see what's in there. Let's just do it. Wow. He's got a knife, that's good. Bats? They can barely see him. Gonna inch my way along in here. Oh, jeez. Oh, shoot. I gotta get out of here then. I don't know what else is in here. Should I keep going? I'm gonna go back. I don't even know how to leave this area. Oh shoot, it's one of these mazes here. Let's go back. Alright, there's the exit. I guess gotta kinda remember where you are, right? I don't think we're going to make it there with him. Oh yeah, that's too long. That's too far away. We're not going to make it. Might as well not even spend our breath doing it. They get to like follow him. You probably only have a certain amount of time to kill him too. Like a certain amount of days. I don't know if we should take a chance in the woods. I mean we're here. Just about. It's just so hard to navigate the woods. If we go in we may never come out. You think the Lost Woods are bad? Right, here we go. So we've come in here. Let's keep going to the right. Shoot. Frig these. Oh, you can duck and throw. I didn't even know that till now. Oh, he's right there. Let's see. We gotta leave now. <laughs> so, okay. Alright, Paul, what can you do here? Just gonna 
do everything you can. Paul's doing well here. Again, I just have no idea how to navigate the woods. Maybe we don't need to. Maybe we just have to survive and kill Jason. Because where would Jason go? He could be around here. I said, I think we only have a certain amount of days. to get more health joy. Yeah, here we go. This is what we want. Because he has the best weapon now. He's got this machete. Like, if you don't have to go into the woods to beat this game, that would be amazing, but I don't... I'm sure there's, like, an item or something that helps you. Like, the torch might be the best weapon. Because if you only have a certain amount of time to kill him, there's no way we'd do it with these weapons that we have. Unless we ran into him more. By the lake. We gotta make it there. We have to. A couple health things that can do some damage on this. Alright, left. Just gotta be careful going here. The birds I'm really worried about. There we go. Shoot. Where the heck? Where'd he go? Go. <laughs> Save the children. There he is. We got his health halfway down. This is as good as we've ever done. Alright. Let's get out of here. Dude, this is so hard to dodge. Oof. Yeah, you have to like inch along. You want to go fast, but that's just going to get you killed. There we go. Jeez. Okay. Come on, give me more health here. It's easily our best run. We've lit almost all the houses. We've done the most damage we've ever done to them. I still don't expect to beat this game, but I still I'm not, I have fun playing this game, honestly. <laughs> you know, it's not that bad. Right, can we make it there now? Ugh. Come on, Paul. Get a few more shots in on Jason here. We have a long way to go to get there. 40 seconds to do so. If we can find a couple more health potions on the way, that would be great. I'll take one, even. Which 
house is this. No. Next house. Oof, that was close. Come on, eight seconds. Alright. Paul's most likely gonna die here, but if we can get at least a little more damage done to him. Some of that, Jason. Whoop. Did my mic just get muted, guys? Did I mute my mic by accident? Right then? I hope I didn't. I think I might have, because I just realized it was off. I think I just bumped it and I might have muted it. If it's been muted for like a long time, I'm so sorry. You guys let me know. I'm sure somebody would have said something, because there's a couple of you watching. You're like, hey, idiot, your thing's muted. I think I just bumped it. And we still have a few characters left, too. This is incredible. Paul's been going for so long. Because I'm getting better at, like, dodging things out in this area, too, and dealing with the enemies. Hoping for more health potions, that would be just fantastic, please. I think the wolves are probably the hardest thing to dodge in the entire game. dropping any items are they and we gotta go back to the lake if we do a little more damage on him come on Paul I think it's one health potion probably two more hits oh crap all right well now I might be able to I gotta try and make it there without getting hit. Oh, fudge. Go, 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 go. Come on, Paul. Oh, you freaking bird. It's so tough because they're higher than you. It's like hard to hit them. You have to be like a certain distance. All right, we're gonna go with Debbie's the closest, so. I still don't think we can make it, can we? Or maybe we can. She doesn't have any good items. Here's a lighter. Come on, give me a knife. We'll do what we can. Go, go, go. I don't know if she has any health vials either. This is not good. Oof. Go fast, go fast. Just go, just go, just go. Alright. She's dead. Wow. Alright, right, Laura and George are the last two we have left. Where is he? He's still at the, the lake. I don't know if she has any health. She's got the good weapon now. She's fast. She might be able to make it there. Maybe do a little bit of damage on him. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, 
Problem is we gotta get through all this. One health. Good job, Laura. Ah, see, sometimes it's so stiff and he just won't work to dodge. Alright, well, it's down to George. This is all we got left. He's still at the lake, my goodness. That's like the worst place to go to get him, too. Because of having to dodge all the stuff in the lake up to him. Actually, we want to go this way, so it'll be quicker. Do -do -do -do. Right now, we're gonna go down this way, I think. Nope, wrong way. George and Jason. Always got his baseballs or rocks, or whatever you want to call them. There you go. So if we could fight him to the death right now and keep up this rhythm, we could actually probably almost beat him. Even though we have no health left. Oh, he's just gonna fight us. He's fighting us to the death right now, I think. Ah, never mind. We can't beat him. Uh, if we had a few more health jars. Maybe. Oh, shite. There we go. You, are, you and your friends are dead. There it is, guys. <laughs> we try. We try. Let's take off the mask. It's getting harder to breathe in there. All right. Hey, that was that was close. That was close. I feel like if we still had another character or two left, and maybe a make a better weapon for one of them, and a few health jars here and there, yeah, we might have been able to beat him. We might have been able to beat him. It looks like he was going to stay there until we killed him. Or he killed us, so... It's just sometimes dodging, like I said, the, the, the controls are very stiff. It's almost delayed, and, like, you have to, like, anticipate it. It's like having to hit, like, the inner corner here of the D-pad is, like, really, really tough to do. You know, and it should just be down, or it should be A or something, you know? One of the buttons you don't have to use during that. To dodge but anyways it's still a fun game that was that was fun that's good now we're gonna play some state of the k2 guys which is gonna be we're going to the lethal zone but thanks for watching this too i appreciate it of course happy halloween by the way any riverdale fans I have a archie riverdale jacket here well, I'm, I'm actually dressed as archie at the white t-shirt Jeans. Um, I love that show. It's my costume, alright? This is actually a great jacket. I'm going to be wearing this a lot just because, like, that's why I bought it. I was like, hmm, what can I be for Halloween? I was thinking of being Mulder, 
but I was like, I didn't have the right stuff, and I, and we were out, and I was like, I found this, bought this, got a t-shirt and everything, um, and this is a jacket I'm just gonna wear anyways, like, out and about, I'm gonna wear this a lot, because it's a really nice jacket, I like it, and it doubles as a costume, so why not, so close, yeah, it was very close, it was very close, alright, let's move on, shall we?